I've always wanted to own my own underwater ROV, but the price to buy one is just way too expensive, especially when with a little planning I can build one for myself. I did a little research online and found blueprints for a simple underwater ROV frame at seaperch.org. I figured I could use this as a starting point to modify the frame for my needs. I decided to build my frame out of half inch PVC pipe cut to the following measurements. Two 14 inch pipes, two six and a half inch pipes, four five inch pipes, two four and a half inch pipes, two four inch pipes, two two and a half inch pipes, and four one and a half inch pipes. In addition, you will also need eight 90 degree half inch elbows, six half inch tees, and four half inch end caps. Once you have cut your pipes, you will need to drill quarter inch holes in six of your elbows. These holes will allow air to escape from the frame as it fills with water. The frame is now complete and you may notice some differences between now and when we first tested this in the bathtub. The big ones being the uh, tubes on top, we've increased the size to one inch tubes. Instead of half an inch they've got more buoyancy and they're allowing the frame to float and also how we've attached them to the frame using clamps instead of zip ties. These are much more secure, they don't seem to move uh, and they offer an easier way to replace the tubes if we have to. Next step will be on the bottom, we're going to put a cargo net or a payload net and then we'll be able to start attaching our thrusters and our electronics. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, don't forget to hit the like button. Also click the subscribe button to follow the rest of this build and see what I get up to next. And as always, if you have questions, comments or suggestions, leave those in the comments below. Thanks for watching.